Wellness Wednesday is brought to you by Adventist Health. Welcome back up to our kitchen. We are joined this morning by Chef Matt Payne and registered dietitian Angela Newton with Morrison Healthcare at Adventist Health. And this morning we have something a little different. We're making baby food today. We are. So September's Well Baby Month. Uh, so we're focusing kind of on mom health and baby health. Uh, so for the next couple of weeks, we're going to kind of focus on these things. Okay. And you know, focus on what we can do for our babies that's nutritious, healthy, and also tastes good too. Mm -hmm. So, which is a big thing for me, because obviously, you know, I wear the white coat. Yes. I like tasting things, so we're gonna <laughs> focus on that. So. And these are pretty simple to make too, which these I are like. Very simple, uh, and it's also a lot more cost effective than buying baby food at the store. Wow. So we have two things we're gonna make today. We're gonna do uh, peaches, and then we're gonna do Okinawan sweet potatoes. So it should be a lot of fun. So we're gonna start with the peaches. Really easy. So we have our blender. You can use uh, an immersion blender, a stick blender. Okay. Um, you can use a food processor. And those are just raw peaches. Just obviously. they've been steamed. Oh, so okay. So either steam or boil everything. Basically, what you're looking for. We can get a little messy. Is you want to be able to squeeze it in your fingers. Okay. So if you can do that, that's, that's fine. Angela, I know a big concern with um, like cooking baby's food. If you are going to puree it, is will it lose all its nutrients by boil it or cook it too long or cook it in the microwave or well, something like that? Well, we want to make certain that we are minimizing the amount of water that we have and capitalizing on everything that we have currently in the soup itself. Okay. Um, once that's done, we can trap those nutrients in the uh, food itself so the baby gets everything that the baby needs. Um, one of the biggest benefits for the baby, not only taking in those nutrients, is the cleanliness of their palate, tasting everything that the chef has right mm -hmm. here for them to, to um, try, as well as making sure that they're transitioning into an oral diet very well. Okay, mm -hmm. all right, wonderful. So we've got our steamed peaches in there and yep. you're gonna spice it up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, we're gonna put a little bit of nutmeg in there. Yum. And then for liquid, because you do wanna add a little bit of liquid, use either breast milk or formula. Okay. Uh, you can use water if you want, but if you can add something, it's gonna add those nutri mm. nutrients that they need, go right Love ahead. That. So just a little, start so with So what are we adding today? So is that formula? This is actually almond milk. Oh, okay. today, so. <laughs> I was just curious what we were tasting. He threw those out there at me. We will simply for say. this, yeah. For okay, this. deal. For us. Exactly. Uh, and then it's really easy. Just you know, turn it on. So for. This is the noisy part. Really, you know, 20, 30 seconds. Okay. We are, we're going to make sure that we are transferring what mom was doing earlier mm -hmm. in her mm -hmm. in her pregnancy into what the baby now needs. Okay. So this is really rich in nutrients, antioxidants, keeping their immune system up. Love that. And uh, mm -hmm. keeping their taste buds healthy. Good, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Introducing them to new flavors. Mm -hmm. All right, so now we have our peach baby food. Our peach baby food. Sounds delish. You gonna try this? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was only almond milk, exactly. so it's essentially a smoothie, uh -huh. right? It is. And you know, you can do fancy things on the plate if you want oh, like that. I'm sure your baby will appreciate yes. that. Uh, <laughs> all right, so we have the first one right here. Can I go ahead? Yes, please. All right, let's see. This no, is, obviously we're not adding good. salt to it or anything like that, but it should have enough natural flavor to it. Yeah, that's that delicious. That it tastes good. That's really good. Yeah. I'd eat that. It's all like right. an applesauce. Exactly. You know, right now, peach sauce. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what's up? So now we're doing the Okinawan sweet potatoes. Um, I love these. Partially for the color. I uh -huh. mean, there's this gorgeous purple color. Uh, we do talk about blue zones too, as I uh -huh. pour these all over the counter. <laughs> um, and so, you know, Okinawan is one of those blue zones too. So we're starting on that blue zone diet okay. as a baby. We're getting them involved right away. Love it. So. And, and it's very deep in color. Mm -hmm. That means it's very deep and rich in antioxidants. Oh, I love it. Again, capitalizing on the immunity uh -huh. and the micronutrients that actually some of them have antifungal effects even. Oh, fantastic. So babies are getting great stuff, mm -hmm. not, you know, adulterating their taste buds too soon. That's great. And again, can you steam these beforehand? Steam these beforehand, so if you look squishable by your fingers. Okay. Uh, we need a little more liquid in here. So okay. I'm gonna do that again. And just play with it, have fun with it. And really, you know, carrots, peas, uh, you can even, you know, do chicken if you want. Oh. Anything that comes in a, you know, would you buy as baby food, mm -hmm. and make it yourself. Um, and if you have older kids, involve them in making it too. Mm -hmm. They can taste it, they can have fun. Uh, Except if it has the breast milk in it. <laughs> yes, that one, stay yeah, possibly on stay that. away from there. <laughs> Save that for baby. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and if they're
there's you know some small lumps, mm-hmm. that's okay as long as they're very soft. I've never so. had an Okinawa sushi before. Try it. They're they're fantastic. There's one you dropped, but yes. Mm. Yeah, um, that's delicious flavor. When I was in Hawaii many years ago, there's a place that makes uh, hamburger buns out of it. Oh, And so they're brown cool. on the outside, and you bite into it, it's this bright, vibrant purple oh, flavor. Oh, how neat. So. Okay. All right. All right, it's a nice little swoosh here again on our plate. Yep. Of our... This one's a little bit thicker. We could throw okay. this out just a little bit more. Um, yeah, we could do a little line. There we go. But there we go. All right, so give it a taste, go. see what you think. And remember, babies are really very attracted to different colors and different mm-hmm. textures, and stimulating their minds in that way, as well as nutritionally, is what we're doing here. Love that. Getting them involved early. That's fantastic. This would be a great mashed potato dish too exactly. also. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, true. That's really good. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna share these recipes on our website. You can mix them up and try different flavors um, yourself as well. Chef Matt and Angela, thank you so much for being with us this morning. We appreciate it. Thank right, you. Thank you everybody. We'll be right back.